Creep Balls! My name is Jonathan Marinara, also known as the Unamazing Pastafarian. Want to know why I chose Pastafarianism? Because wouldn't beer volcanoes and stripper factories be awesome? Seriously, that is my idea of heaven. Also, cheeseburger pits and being able to fly. But being a Pastafarianism, Worshipping the flying spaghetti monster, maybe I will fly in heaven! Yay! But let's face the truth. That is not pastafarianism. Or is it? You can't prove it. You can't disprove it. I was a Scientologist. Getting into the whole jizz of us being brought here by aliens and me thinking that Tom Cruise is my biological son. I don't know, I'm 32 right now. Isn't he like 97, 105? 1752. I don't know. He's pretty fucking old compared to me anyway. Anyway, I'd like to talk to you about how I discovered Pastafarianism. In 2004, I fell off my chair because the mean kids were soaring a leg underneath me. And I fell off it and I passed out and woke up in a day to the smell of pasta. And I was thinking, wasn't the sweet aroma of spaghetti that saved my life and performed that miracle. So I decided to look into it. And after some research, I discovered the religion of Pastafarianism, also known as the Church of the Flying Spaghetti Monster. It makes so much sense now. I read up about it and how the universe was created. The Flying Spaghetti Monster first created a mountain, a midget, and a tree. He rested for three days, and then created the rest of the universe for three days after that. It makes so much sense! It can't, can it not be true? Every Friday is a religious holiday. I've always wondered why I was so excited on Fridays. And now I know why. Pastor Faridism is the true, undenying religion of this universe. I wear the spaghetti strainer on my head at all times, even in the shower. Even when I get my hair cut, the barber has to try and, you know, get underneath this thing. Unfortunately for him, I have a very big head. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Pizza out. Oh, wait. That's the wrong Italian dish.